well, well done to Leon there, winning the Gold Cup, which puts him on four wins, along with uh, Craig Annan and Leon with just four races to go. Those three sit at the top of the leaderboard. Anyway, we've got the St. James Palace Place Hunters Chase up next, which is three miles, two and a half furlong. Sapphire and Steel for Martin Liebman's our top weight. In spring and relief for James Shea. Catching over hassle for Thomas Rogers. Louise Practice, Martin Liebman. Yikamu Cow Aurora for James Shea. Days of Number, Pontypool Racing, Quality Queen, Stu Gray. Aliusca Skahol, Alex Cherry, and Hello Bud for Obi Wan makes up nine of the smaller trainers. Get a chance to win something here at Cheltenham. Already racing here. Through the first half furlong. And it's days are numbered that leads us into the first. So it's a great clash of luck. Still looking for a, a Cheltenham win up. Maybe stand a chance with days are numbered as they come into the second. We're all over that. Catching over Hassan and that Yika Mukawa Roar are a little bit uh, slow going. So as they go uphill now, away from us in the grandstand. Three miles to go, and it's days are numbered that's going to lead us from Insperina, ready for the Luska Hole Wide, and the two Martin Lieben horses, Louise Practice, and Sapphire, and still between those is Obi Wan's Hello Bud, pushing through to Quality Queen, and just at the rear, catching over Hassel and Yiko Mukau Aurora. With this leader, days are numbered, leads by about four, gets into the third, and take that well, slow low, where it was Yiko Mukau Aurora at the rear. So days are numbered for Grey Clutterbuck. President leads by five to Sapphire and Still up against the fence. Up to the fourth, the water all over that as well. To a little bit wider, in in the relief, and Alex Cherry's Aluska hole. Still looking for that elusive fourth win to get him up to the top of the leaderboard. Oh, and we've lost one. Sapphire and Still's gone for Martin Leader. Unlucky. He's really not had a good Cheltenham so far. He'll be complaining in his comms, I'm sure. But it's, it's days are numbered that leads us. And the chasing pack, which are all close together. Wine is still always six wide, and that's a loose skahol. Yika Mukau Aurora, just a length and a half off that pack. Big open ditch, and we'll get over there as well. So, days are numbered. Leads us downhill now. By about five. Bit slower over that, the eighth. Got to jump by Yika Mukau Aurora. They get a little bit of air. Got closer now. Hello, Bud. And the yellow silks for only one. But still, this day's are numbered. Shorten his lead now to about four from catching over Hassel. It's the ninth. Catching over Hassel took a lovely great jump at that. Comes up at length out of the main chasing pack. As the first, the, uh, as they're through the first mile, and a couple of miles still to run. Its days are numbered. Still another 12 fences to take. We go over the tenth. Oh, we've lost one there. Inspirina relief has gone. Lucky to James Shea. No, he's still got Yiko Mukau Aurora in this one. So the trainers that came here mob-handed have both lost their second runners. Now it makes it fair. So days are numbered, still leading us by about five to catch an over hassle and loose skahol. Louise practice and quality queen up against the fence and you can move cow aurora. And hello bud just bring up the rear at the moment. We'll get to the eleventh, they'll get over that one. Stepped over it was you can move cow aurora. He's still on his feet. And we go past the grandstand and twelfth. Which will be our last next time round. A mile and a half to travel. Days are numbered. Catch him over Hassel and Louise practice the loose skull. Quality Queen, Hello Bud. And Yika Mukau Aurora. We're down a couple. Which was inspiring a relief and sapphire and still the top weight. This days are numbered. Been leading since the beginning. Only one from pillar to post with a bit of luck. So come to the 13th. Oh, and he went, oh, he's gone. He went straight through it. That certainly was unlucky. Jockey still down. So, unseated his rider. That looked worse than that. But unlucky to great. So, that adult time lead is gone. That's left catcher Nova Hassel in the lead for Tom Rogers. By just a length and a half. The loose horse is still there. Days unnumbered. It calls Louise practice a little bit of a problem. Takes a little hold. Moving up on the rally. It's hallowed bud as we get to the 15th. All over that. 
Well, Louis's practice was a little bit slow, but it's this catching over hassle that leads us from Hallow Bugger, Loose Gahol. Quality Queen, Louise practice. Oh, I went through the top of that as well. Yuka Muka Cow Aurora passes in now as Louise practice slips back into the last position. But it's catching over hassle. Still leads. Loose horse in the way. Hello, Bud and a loose go hole. There you go. Quality Queen. Louise practice. Yuka Muka Cow Aurora. Oh, and we've lost another one. There's another one this time. It's Alex Cherry's a, Alex Cherry's a loose go hole. And again, this fourth winner of the festival. So we're down to five now. Now we'll pick up a bit of money here as we've lost four as I get to the 18th. These fences uh, are finding out these hunter chasers. So it's catching over hassle still from Obi-Wan's Hello Bud. Moving well on the outside is Stu Gray's Quality Queen. Then moving even better is Louise Practice to get to, up to the lead. And then Yukamuka Aurora's not asked for anything yet. So as we come inside the five. Oh, and we've lost this time. We've lost Louise Practice. Unseat the Friday. We're down to four now. And it's been a bloodbath this race, and it's catching over hassle from Quality Queen, Hello Bud, and Yika Moo Cow Aurora. It's moving up on the outside now, so we're inside the final five furlongs, and it's catching over hassle. But it's Yika Moo Cow Aurora rises first and takes the lead from Quality Queen in second, catching over hassle, to, starting to tread water, running on still with Hello Bud. So there's just the four left inside the final half mile, and it's Yuka Moo Cow Aurora, and Quality Queen's asked for a little bit more, and it's Quality Queen that takes it up as we come down to the next. Quality Queen from Yika Moo Cow now Aurora, hello, Bud, catching over hassle. We've still got two and a half furlongs to run, a couple to jump, and it's Quality Queen. Still leads by a couple from Yika Mukau Aurora. Hello, Bud, still trying to run on, catching over hassle, trying to have a second wind, but they're over the penultimate. It's still this Quality Queen, leads by about four or five. Here comes Obi Wan's Hello, Bud. We've still got a furlong and a half, one to jump. He gets over it a little bit slow. Quality Queen from Hello, Bud, as they go uphill now with a furlong to run, and it's Quality Queen still leading from Hello, Bud. Yika Mukau Aurora and catching over hassle and nowhere and it's Quality Queen inside the final half of Furlong coming uphill yes it's going to be a win for Stu Gray it's going to take the winner of the Cheltenham Festival with Quality Queen and Hello Bud was second, third was catching over hassle fourth was Yika Mugao Aurora get in probably fortunate that five of them fell but at least mine stood on his feet and I get a win which I'm pleased about well done, Quality Queen. You want that with hands. Well, plenty from Hallow Bud and Obi Wan. Well done. Third was Catching Over Hassle for Tom Rogers. Fourth was Yika Mukau Aurora for James Shea. That was just our four finishers. So the leaderboard doesn't change. It's still Craig Allen, Leon, and Josh at the top with four apiece. I'll hand you back to Martin. Oh no, I'm doing the next one.